Hi there, it's Mark Sebastian, the founder of Option Pit, and this is the Vol Report. Reminder, this is for education purposes only. Shouldn't be considered investment advice. Options have risk. Consult your financial professional. So, hey, today is my 40th birthday, so I have a present for you guys. Remember, if you use coupon code Happy Birthday Mark, you can buy gold for 40% off. That is the cheapest we have sold gold, I think, in six years. And it's just because I'm only going to turn 40 once. Uh, it's a pretty, it's a great value. It also comes with two weeks of the Vol Report and two weeks of the Breakout Bulletin. Um, probably the single best dollars you can spend on yourself uh, if you really want to get good at trading and you really want to become an expert option trader. If you hate the course, I'll give you your money back anyway. So don't be a jerk. Don't be an idiot. If you haven't taken the gold membership, go to Option Fit Members. Look up uh, look and look up that gold membership and, and purchase it using coupon code Happy Birthday Mark. The H, the B, and the M R capital. So when you sign, you write sign me up, and then yeah, you use coupon code Happy Birthday Mark. There it is, and apply, and it'll only be nine hundred dollars. That's steal. All right. Speaking of steals, how about this market? Uh, you know, we've been down as much as uh, 20 overnight. Uh, vol is up today. But as I review the news, it seems like more of the same. Adjusted for the weekend, VIX is starting to flatten up. I suspect we'll see VIX futures fall off too. Um, and the entire vol complex as a whole. The NDX has gotten really strong. It's getting a lot stronger. We're also seeing some strength out of IWM. When IWM and the NASDAQ have been the leader, the market has not been able to hold sell-offs. And that seems to be the case today. That mean, that makes me think, hey, decent odds that we're going to go uh, reasonably higher. You can see Apple showing some real strength now. Um, in the news, Tesla. How about them? 7,000 cars in a week. What? Maybe they did it. Maybe they didn't. But, um, you know, the market seems to believe them. That's uh, going to help them with their cash flow makes the feasibility of the stock uh, much, much better. Um, you know, we continue to see oil uh, hold around 15. That's a, for USO. That's, you know, near 70 for um, WTI. And that is a clear sign of how much strength there is in uh, the oil names. Uh, a lot of the big tech names are also looking pretty good. DVMT is the Dell tracking stock. And um, they're gonna be removing this, taking it private, that's why it's up so much. Um, looking for a new version of Dell to go public, which will be kind of interesting. Uh, continue to see GE, yeah, it's amazing. The, the, leaving the Dow tends to be mean that you're, your stock's gonna go up. And we continue to see that with, you know, GE's off today, but it looks stronger. Uh, Transpose looks stronger too. Um, and, uh, you know, Watch those energy names. XLE has been strong. Uh, it's hanging around right right around 75. I think there's probably some plays there. Those are going to be kind of the main things I look at. We're, we're having kind of a dark week in that we're not going to be doing a lot of stuff. But I will be coming on. I'll try to come on every day and, and do like at least a little mini chat. Um, today I'll be doing one around 1030. But, uh, yeah, if you've not taken gold yet and it's something you're thinking about doing – you have until the 5th, so that's Thursday, to get yourself registered. Do it. You will be happy. Um, and then, yeah, just kind of everything down marginally. But I like the market to go green. I do. And I think you could see uh, VIX red on the day. Um, I think I'd fade uh, VXX and VIX futures here and, and may set up uh, some sort of uh, VIX futures fade. Because I, I just don't see VIX staying uh 17 or, uh, you know, that high for, for very long. Um, I'm, not, I'm not a firm believer in uh, the current long-term uh, long vol. So I, I may be messing around. This is another day to, to be readjusting where one's long volatility exposure is and moving that around. And I will be doing some of that as well. All right, folks, if you have questions, you can email me, marketoptionpit.com. Or you can call me 888-TRADE-01. All right, everybody, have a great afternoon and I will, or great morning, and I'll talk to you soon.